bonjour à toutes et à tous. Je suis ici, nous sommes ici pour apprendre le français, pour apprendre encore le français, to learn French again. And my name is, I'm not going to say my name is, I'm say, je m'appelle Francis, okay? Je m'appelle Francis, you've learned how to tell your name, okay? And I'm your French tutor here at Learn City. How do you ask for people's name? Now, let's, let's look at English. If you want to ask for someone's name in English, you can say, what's your name? All right? What's your name? Your name is, your name is, you can also say, um, what do you call yourself? Can I say, how do you call yourself? Or what would you like, you, like us to call you? All right? You can also say, I mean, in some places, you go by, <laughs> I go by, right? You go by, or he goes by, you know. All of these, you know, differences are permissible in English, although not all might be correct, totally correct, but they are permissible. So we're seeing the same thing in in in, in French. There are it's also the same way you can can just manipulate and change. Okay, basically, if you want to ask for someone's name, you're saying tu t'appelles. Comment? Tu t'appelles comment is what is your name? Or comment tu t'appelles? You know this. Comment tu t'appelles? Comment tu t'appelles? Now, that means comment tu t'appelles is like what's your name? Okay. Now you cannot, you're not changing it to say tu t'appelles comment. Right? Now if you listen to some other French speakers, they can say tu t'appelles quoi? You call yourself what you know it's changing it's changing like to appel qua or to appel qua it it's not language is not you just have to like know how these people do all of this um you know have all of these differences or the way they communicate the way they speak say comment to appel you just so you don't expect everybody to say comment to appel comment to appel all the time some people can say to appel comment or some people can say, tu t'appelles quoi? Or some people can say, ton nom c'est quoi? Ton nom is your name. Ton nom c'est quoi? So that means you're going to learn, a you're going to hear a lot of things or a lot of like different phrases, but they mean the same thing. Different phrases when you ask, when people ask for names or your name. Or when you ask for, you can use different phrases when you ask for people's names. Okay. Comment tu t'appelles? Okay. You have to reply. Have you forgotten? Je m'appelle. Or moi, c'est. Okay. Tu t'appelles. Je m'appelle Francis. Moi, c'est Francis. It's simple. Okay. You have to like communicate. You have to speak. Just for yourself to say, je m'appelle. As I say, je m'appelle, you say, je m'appelle too. As I say, as I say, moi c'est Francis, you say, moi c'est Temidayo. I'm hi, me, I'm Francis, basically. Do you understand? And you're going to ask, you say, tu t'appelles quoi? You don't always expect, uh, comment tu t'appelles? So when, when someone says, tu t'appelles quoi? Don't be like, oh, what does this mean? It means the same thing, what's the name? Or ton nom c'est quoi? I've watched and listened to um, some French, like in Africa especially, there are different ways people speak. It can also be like, like, who is, who is he? If you want to say, who is he? Say, qui? Now, if you want to ask someone older than you, okay, I mean the person's name, say, vous vous appelez comment? Vous vous appelez comment? It's the same way you can change. You can say, comment vous vous appelez? Or comment vous appelez-vous? Vous vous appelez comment? Vous vous, double. Vous vous appelez comment? Vous is for respect. Okay? Or two, toi is for like familiar situation. Vous vous appelez. You're going to learn that the verb s'appeler, okay, is a 
is a pronominal verb. It's a verb that requires a preposition, okay? That requires a pronoun, sorry. That requires a pronoun. That's why it's called pronominal verb. It's a verb that requires a pronoun. That is why if I call, then there must be something I call, which is I call myself, okay? Or you call yourself, or he calls herself. That is why you're having the double like tu, tapel, okay, t apostrophe, right? That is why you have je m'appelle, okay, if you're like telling your name, j e m apostrophe, m'appelle, okay, vous, vous, like you have the double for vous appeler. Or you could ask for someone's, someone's name, just say, il s'appelle comment? Il s'appelle comment? Elle s'appelle comment? What's your what's his name? That is, il s'appelle comment? What's her name? Elle s'appelle comment? Or comment? Elle s'appelle or comment? Il s'appelle. So you can you can change this in various ways, and when you expose yourself to the classroom setting or you watch beginners um, conversation all right you're going to see that there, there, there are different ways which i've explained that all of these can be what can be changed and it makes a lot of sense now you can ask for someone's name then you can also tell your what your name now let's bring it back to the classroom setting i'm in a class that i mean this first time in my class uh, this is the first time in my class and say bonjour à tous et à tous bonjour mes étudiants and of course, you have to know that French conversations will not be so, you know, so like, so slow like that. It's, it has to be fast. Not like it has to be fast, but conversations are fast. Like these conversations are, are this, this class I'm, and I'm having with you now is fast, right? I'm not like picking words. I'm not going to say, uh, comment tu t'appelles? Or uh, say, Tu t'appelles comment? C'est tu t'appelles comment? No, it's going to be fast. Like, t'appelles quoi? Ton nom c'est quoi? Ton nom c'est quoi? Okay, comment tu t'appelles? Tu t'appelles comment? It's going to be fast. Like, vous appelez comment? Or comment vous appelez co uh, vous? Okay, it's going to be fast. Like, that's what you expect. Je m'appelle. Je m'appelle. Je m'appelle. So you have to like train your ears to adapt to the fastness fastness of the conversation to the speed of the conversation it's not going to be like slow speed so i'm going to enter the class and say bonjour à toutes et à tous bonjour mes étudiants okay like hi everyone like very fast hi everyone yeah hi everyone no like salut tout le monde okay or salut à toutes et à tous but like bonjour à toutes et à tous say bonjour professor bonjour la classe bonjour professor uh, you see here, okay, like you see here, on apprend le français. We are learning French, on apprend le français. So it's gonna like, let's say, this is the French class, is like, it's, it's, the class is being tutored by a French person, okay? They're just gonna adapt, which is gonna be hard, but you could adapt, say, okay, you see, on apprend le français, we're learning French, okay? Let's say, je m'appelle Francis Ikurowo, okay, ton professeur, your teacher, okay, ton professeur. So you're going to say, oh, mm, ton professeur, like your teacher, say, okay, vous vous appelez comment, what is your name? And you're going to say, je m'appelle, or moi c'est, so you can communicate, you can have that basic communication in, in French. And besides, if you're meeting someone, so you don't know whether you're older than the person and, or the person is older than you or whatever, just have to say vous. Just use vous, vous. Okay, if the person is a stranger, use vous, vous appelez comment, or comment vous appelez vous, just to show that respect. Now, next video, we're going to be learning how to ask for people's name, uh, people are how to ask for someone's age, and how to tell your own age. Stay with us. Don't forget to like this video if you really enjoy the class and you're moving, you're progressing, okay? And subscribe and turn on your post notifications so that you wouldn't miss any video. Welcome to the world of learning. 
another language.